everybody and welcome to the channel. My name is of course Constantine and today in the world of indie gaming we're finally gonna check out Skill Attack. Now this game has actually been released very recently like three days ago or something like that and uh, I just managed to grab a copy here from developers which I would like to take a moment here and thank Konami for sending in a copy to check out the game and feature on the channel and of course if you all enjoy this and want me to continue this series make sure to hit on that like button down below as that will definitely encourage me to keep on going. So what is Skill Attack? Well Skill Attack is about Scully our main hero here we are gonna have to fight our way through the underworld in order to reclaim a stolen magic. Not quite sure exactly what to expect, I've watched just a little bit of gameplay on YouTube, but uh, I didn't want to watch too much, I didn't want to explore it for myself. So of course, without further ado, let's jump straight into the adventure here and uh, explore this game together. Let's see what this is all about. Come now, Iber. You can't really believe that. It's true. Why would I lie about this? You can honestly believe there is an... an... Uh, what did you call it? Uberbat. Yeah, an uh, Uberbat. That is more beautiful and powerful than any other bath. I don't believe it. The Uberbat sees all. The Uberbat knows all. The Uberbat is all. <laughs> Have you ever seen it? I don't need to see her. Not it. Her. Show some respect. I just know she is there, watching over all the battlings like myself. Being generally amazing basically at all the time. I think you sound unhinged. I think your jaw should unhinge. <laughs> anyway, after village hopping tonight, we better get the move on unless we want to miss out on all the fun. <laughs> oh my god. Are you freaking kidding me? This is gorgeous. And of course, as you guys know, I really, really enjoy playing these type of beautiful games, that's for sure. Uh, before we go anywhere though, let's see what this is all about. Oh, is this our home? We cannot climb. <laughs> I don't know exactly what I'm doing here. But uh, yeah, this is definitely our home, I believe. Let's just get out of here. Man, this is looking absolutely gorgeous. Love it. Loving every single second of it. I'm mean, looking at all the creatures in here and all the skellies. <laughs> um, where am I supposed to go though? Hold on, can I have a chat with this guy? You're looking for Elzadon? I believe I saw him in the Goblin Goblet. Goblin's Goblet. That old geezer loves to sing and dance like he's still fresh of his awakening. Huh. Let's have a chat with this guy. My crew and I are working on a comprehensive tunnel system that spawns the entire dungeons. Feel free to use them whenever you like. Cavians are highly unlikely. Oh, look at this. That is awesome. Hit your right, close. Yeah, I don't want to go inside there just yet. Uh, so apparently we gotta find... somebody. Let's have a chat with the old lady. Keep an eye out for bone broth while adventuring. I always leave some extras hidden through the dungeon. I just can't help but worry about you young ones going hungry. <laughs> Alright, um... Hmm... I mean, is this where I gotta go? Oh yeah, this is the Goblin's Goblet. And apparently this is the guy that we gotta talk to. Scully! Imber! So glad to see you! I'm sure you understand why everyone is so excited around after Vale. Sure, Elder, it's so welcoming. We got a new deal, friends. Indeed, the new dwellers means we kept our secrets safe from escaping above ground. Besides that... What better way to celebrate the first day of the rest of our afterlives? <laughs> I still remember my welcoming. Me too. You screamed a lot. <laughs> it didn't help that you kept dive bobbing my head. Scully, you've come a long way since you first arrived here. Once over the shock of being reanimated, you adapted to the dungeon like a demon to fire. Quickly mixing into dweller life. Offering help as needed and making fast friends. You have an incredible ability to overcome, adapt, and thrive. And so, dear boy, I'll believe you are ready to start your remembrance. Huh, I don't know, Elder Elzadon. I've been quite content since my awakening. A Dungeon Dweller Remembrance is a special time. It is what makes us whole. We see who we were and learn all there is to know about ourselves. Without the remembrance, your past comes back to you in pieces. It is very jarring. This introduces the process, makes it more full and understandable. 
Hmm. I'm guessing he's talking about a tutorial here, right? Your point is well made, but I'm not sure if I'm going to take anything away from it. Who I was is not who I am. <laughs> Wonderfully put! Which is even further proof that you are ready. I'd suggest you get some rest tonight, young Scully. Tomorrow, we will begin your remembrance by having you travel the path of the warrior. Mm. But that means I wasn't worried my past life? Many more exciting truths lie ahead, Scully. That is just one small piece. I will only tell you to prepare yourself, as the path of the warrior is very challenging. But I know you'll make it, and I'll be there to greet you at the end when you finish. For now, the last torch is to be snuffed. Rest up for tomorrow. Very well, Elder Ilzadon. See you tomorrow. Alright, so apparently uh, we are done with this. Let's have a chat with this guy. Welcome to the Goblin's Goblet. <laughs> what is so important about remembering who I was, anyway? How should I know skulls? I was born down here. There is nothing for me to remember. Shucks. What? I find myself feeling oddly jealous that I don't have a secret backstory to learn about. What self-respecting Bath would ever be jealous of a skeleton? I have chained all of bad kinds. Be serious for a second, Limber. What if I don't want to know who I was? What if I learn something I don't like? Skulls, you're way overthinking this and you don't even have a brain to think with. <laughs> Every skeleton I've ever known has gone through a remembrance with the help of Elzadon. He knows what he is doing. You can trust him. If he says that this is the time, well, then it's time. Okay, okay. Besides, the night is young, and by the upper bat, I am gonna enjoy myself. I will appreciate if my best friend would join me if I'm doing so. What do you want to do, bat? Not sure. I wish we could enjoy all this without having to get lost in the chaos. I think I have the perfect idea. <laughs> All right, what's happening here? Ah, oh, there we go. I love it that we have these beautiful scenes, though. This is looking amazing. This, this is perfect, isn't it? Though, I wish the Uberbad was here to see this. Could life possibly get any better? How should I know? <laughs> I see what you did there, you undead jokester, you. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm loving this. Imber, it's time to go. The elder's probably already waiting for me. Get dressed. You're so funny. You should stretch, get your muscles ready for the path of the warrior. Too mean. Love you. <laughs> yeah, she says that because we ain't got no muscles, we just got bones. <laughs> Alright, so, apparently it is morning. Everybody is back in their homes, I guess, sleeping or something like that. There are, there are a few of them outside, though, so... Let's just see, where is the Elder? What if I fail, Imber? What if I'm not meant to know who I am? What if I'm not up to the challenges I am faced to on the path of the warrior? What if is a question that doesn't come with an answer, Skulls? You gotta give it a shot. As for whether or not you're ready to take this path of the warrior. I will never let anything bad happen to you, dummy. Besides, you're awesome. You got this. You're the best, Imber. <laughs> I suppose I'd give it a go. I'm ready. Let's do this. Alright, so um, apparently we gotta enter this dungeon or crypt that uh, opened up for us. Let's see what this is all about. Okay, so I'm guessing this is uh, some sort of a tutorial. Oh, it's showing me that I can jump over these platforms. I get it. And here, we can use double jumps. Oh, snap. <laughs> I didn't even even notice that. So apparently those are like spikes. Interesting. Try to jump between these two walls by jumping on the wall and pressing the left and right button. Oh, this is awesome. We can also slide. That is so cool. There we go. Looks like we need to find a key. And I'm guessing the key that we need to find is right up here. Hmm. 
Pull up. I need to get used to this. There we go. Alright, and I'm pretty sure this is gonna be the key that we need, right? Huh. There we go, we got it! Oh, key bony, you know how this works. If something uh, ultimately happens while you're gallivanting around the dungeon and you suddenly cease to exist, you'll find yourself back at the Immortal Coil, at whichever one of these blue flames you last pass. Scrolling past the blue flames will also save your progress. Alright, so I'm guessing this is a checkpoint. That is awesome. Crap, just like that. <laughs> Dang it. This is definitely not gonna be easy. It's gonna take uh, a little bit of getting used to. Uh, let's first try to grab this. Not quite sure where these are, but I'm pretty sure we are gonna find out real soon. Uh, currently, we have just five. Alright, there we go. Ah, snap. Oh, and those things that I just grabbed, you are gonna lose them. In order to grab them back, I'm gonna have to go back where I died. What? How am I supposed to grab them if I'm... God dang it. Hmm. Oh, snap. I think I totally forgot. I, I think I totally lost those things. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we lost those things. And apparently, we do have some health here. We gotta pay attention. Oh, we can also duck. That is awesome. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's keep going. Nope, almost died there. Alright, there we go. And use this lever. Can I use the lever? No. Wait, can I actually use this lever? It doesn't look like... I have a feeling we may need some abilities in order to open up some stuff. And also in order to break this down, I'm definitely gonna have to break this down as well. I think that this game is gonna have some uh, Metroidvania style to it, right? If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's gonna be a thing. And I think this is where we're gonna have to do a uh, ground pound or something like that. Oh crap. We gotta pay attention here, I don't wanna die. Alright, there we go, so we just saved the game, that is perfect. I'm gonna have to jump all the way on that platform over here. Dang it! Hmm... Well, that sucked. At least I got my thing back. No! Dang it. I hate this. <laughs> definitely gonna get a little bit of getting used to, that's for sure. Come on, there we go. Alright, this seems to be a pretty enjoyable platformer though. Not to mention the artwork, the artwork is definitely making it feel much, much better. I'm curious if there's gonna be some collectibles that I need to find. Scully, look! What the... Whoa, what the heck is that? I'm sending this old wretch away, corpse scum. Somewhere you can't find him. The undead will be vanquished, and the humans shall thrive. Oh, what the heck? Ozodon! Well, look at this, we just got ourselves a sword. The Bone Sword. This legendary weapon was once used by a mighty warrior to defend the dungeon. It was left here in the shrine, unused for centuries, until now. Okay, so apparently we gotta use... J. Hmm. Do I have a dodge ability or something? We shall prevail. Where is the elder? He is ours. The raid bells. Let's go. Huh. Is somebody raiding the town? How do I go back? Hold up, we gotta figure this out. Something is definitely not right here. I have a feeling I gotta go all the way back. Oh, there we go. We can take a shortcut now. Interesting. Ah, oh, crap. Seriously? Dang it. <laughs> we completely lost that. We lost all the blue uh, emeralds or whatever that is. Crap. Man, this is not easy. I bet this game is made to be played with the controller. 
We might be a little bit better if we play this on a controller, that's for sure. Alright, let's save the progress here. Come on, Scully. We gotta get the heck out of here. But first, let's grab the chest. There we go. Five emeralds. Hopefully I'm not gonna die again. Alright, there we go. And we should be good. There we go. What the heck is happening, though? Huh. The humans are invading! Scully, Imber, they're not even trying to take treasure. They're walking right past everything. They're just marching and torching and... How many are there? Too many to count. It's an army. They've been coming in through the sewers. They'll likely be heading back that way too. No other tactical position outside of there. Besides, they'll be wanting to disrupt our water supply. Even though we're not relying on it, human villagers are. They can't help but think like humans. <laughs> what in gold graze earth are you staring at? Did you just hear yourself? Were you some military genius of all all of a sudden? I, 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 well, I mean, that is to say... Whatever, it made a lot of sense, so what should we do? Head into the sewers? Jab, tell whoever will listen that Imber and I are off to try and find the Elder. We're gonna try to take care of the humans, too, if there's anything we can do. How are you gonna stop them? I'm not sure, but we have to try. Okay, Scully, you and Imber, be careful. Right, so I think we gotta go through here, right? Uh, first of all, let's go inside here for a second. Let's see what this is all about. If you two acquire any magic abilities you on your travels, come back to see me. I will help you hone them for a price. Huh. Now, what's the price gonna be? I mean, I'm pretty sure he needs those embers from me, right? I just don't know exactly know how to give them to him. Maybe you don't have to give him just yet, or maybe the blacksmith, I don't know. Let's have a chat with him. Bring my rare metals to find to me. I'll use it to make the blade much stronger for you. Alright. I mean, I do have some, I just don't know how to give them to you. <laughs> Look at this, I have seven. How do I give them to him? I'm looking for a new apprentice. Interested? I'm more of a wielder of weapons than maker of them. The maker of them. Suit yourself with armor that I made by myself. <laughs> I wish there was a way to dodge, though. That's a curious weapon, there, boy. What say you to let me study it sometime? With some rare metal. It may even be made more deadly. Yeah, I mean, I want to do that, I just don't exactly know how to give them to this guy. Let's have a chat with this guy. Pages from our book, A History of Dungeon, were lost during a human raid. If you find any book pages while exploring, you can read them here. Oh, I get it. Interesting. So probably we're gonna get a little bit of a story. Alright, in that case, let's uh, go for the mission here. Let's go inside the gate. Let's go through the gate. So apparently, this one is taking us... Huh. All the way at the top. Let's have a chat with this guy. Trying to get into the sewers? I tried a big old pipe up there. Huh. Alright, I'm definitely gonna have to try that. Uh, this is the lava fort we cannot... Which we cannot visit just yet. And this is the granary, which again, we cannot visit just yet. So let's just try to go on top of this sewer here. There we go. I think I'm getting the hang of this, that's for sure. Oh, we can also swim! <laughs> that is awesome. That's a potion, but I'm not quite sure exactly what that does. Oh god, I just noticed the freaking crocs. <laughs> Man, this looks so good. Uh, we are gonna need a key here, that's for sure. Alright, there we go, some more health. 
which we didn't really need at the moment, but... Oh, look at this guy. What the heck? She seems to be like a human. It's so nice to see new faces around here. If you two are looking for the humans, then you gotta keep on going. If I was a betting woman, which I'm not, I guess they were headed to the upper sewers. If you see my husband, Norm, tell him I don't care what's going on in the sewers. He better not be late for dinner. <laughs> um, oh, look at this. This is actually a secret area. Interesting. And we just got ourselves some, um, some more emeralds or whatever this is. And there's gonna be some more health that currently we don't really need. Alright, and I think I gotta go through here. Oh yeah, there's the key that I need. There we go, and I think we're actually done. We can go back now. Ah, oh, snap. Are you kidding me? Come on. I'm gonna have to get my stuff back here. Come on, buddy. There we go. And we cannot open up the door. Perfect. Alright, so we got this saved. Um, let's try to figure this out. No! God dang it. Freaking Crocs, man. No! Are you kidding me? <laughs> Come on! Yeah, you gotta pay attention here. What? I didn't even see that. And I died again. God dang it. Come on, buddy. There we go, got him. Perfect. Alright, I wish I had a weapon that I could throw at these enemies. Oh my god, this looks so dangerous. Oh, a piece of those papers that we can get a little bit of a story. Interesting. Definitely want to check it out. Nope. <laughs> Nobody. Oh my god, seriously, I just lost all that. There we go, we got him. Now, I wanna pay attention here, I don't wanna die. That was close, so close. I wish I could save this though, so I, that I don't lose this again. But uh, let's keep on going. No, 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 no. Man, this game is not gonna be easy, that's for sure. I'm gonna struggle quite a lot here, pretty sure about it. Alright, so we got all the way up here. What now? Oh, let's try to go to the left side and here. Perfect. We got a new save. Alright. This is really cool. Oh, what the heck? Oh, I think that's aiming straight at me. I get it. No! Dang it! That dude is doing a lot of damage. He is almost dead though, so hopefully I can find some health somewhere. Oh my god. That dude is quite strong. Come on, there we go, we got it. Perfect. Uh, next up, let's try to make it all the way here so that we can save. Perfect. That thing cannot get to us, which is great. And I think we are all good here. Um, there is another creature. This slime. Not quite sure what that is. I have a feeling though, because judging by its color, if I destroy it, I may actually get some health. Oh, if I stay close to it, he's giving me health. Interesting. That is awesome. That is really good to know. Alright, let's keep going. Know exactly what we gotta do next. And we should be good. Perfect. Alright, so we got all that going. Um, hmm. I see a secret chest on the right side. I'm gonna have to figure out how to get to it though. Can I hit this guy from here? No. <laughs> Let's just spawn in here first. 
There we go, buddy. And we got that as well. Awesome. Now, I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna be able to go... Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna be able to go open up that chest. At least not from here. Maybe if we keep on climbing, we are gonna eventually make it to that place. I see a key here that I'm pretty sure I'm gonna need. I was almost there. Let's try this again. Alright, there we go. Dang it. There's gonna be a large... Emerald there that I'm pretty sure I need. It's not gonna be easy to grab though. I may just risk it all if I try it. Hmm. There we go, we got it. Interesting. That was not that bad. Alright, let's keep going. So we are gonna have to get to this guy. There we go, buddy. The problem is we are almost there. We're gonna have to find another one of those green slime somewhere or just a save game that's good as well never mind let's try to get through here there we go health finally <laughs> this is really good and we made it all the way at the top yeah I'm really hoping that in the future we are gonna find some sort of a dodge because currently all we can do is just run back, but we cannot really dodge. Uh, let's just see. Because I do have a feeling that this game has a Metrovania style to it, I'm pretty sure about it. <laughs> that is awesome. Alright, so if I go down here, we are going to have a box we can break with just a few more emeralds. Oh my god, seriously? Alright, let's try to grab all that stuff back then. It's not gonna be easy, but I'm pretty sure we can do it. No, I want it all. Wait a minute. Okay, now how the heck am I gonna... Am I supposed to get out of here? Isn't this the main area? Oh my god. Seriously? Holy crap, I don't wanna die. I don't want to lose my stuff, dude. Come on. Whew. Okay, so we got... So we got this going. Let's try to figure it out. Get out of here. There we go. I don't care if I die this time because... I got all my stuff back. Um, and actually, what I think I'm gonna do... I think I'm gonna intentionally die here just so that I can grab it. So that, just so I can get my health back. And now I'm definitely ready to keep on going. Question is, what am I supposed to do here? Hmm. How am I supposed to get to that new area? Q. So we do have an inventory apparently. That is interesting. Never used an inventory, not sure what that is all about. And also, I don't know exactly know where I gotta go next. Oh, never mind. We got the key. This is where we gotta go. Hmm. Okay, so we definitely have to climb up here somehow. Come on, buddy. There we go. Got you. Uh, let's try to make it all the way up here. Oh god, this one is not gonna be easy. There we go! <laughs> Who said it's not gonna be easy? It definitely was. Right, let's keep going. So if we die here, I don't really care because... We did save the game. That is great. Let's grab all this. I think I want this guy to actually kill me. <laughs> Never mind. I want this thing to kill me, or maybe... Yeah, I definitely don't want to die by these things, because I am going to lose all my coins. Crap. Well, there we go. There we have it. Now we died. At least these things don't kill me instantly. That's why it's so good. Uh, let's see. I think I know how I do this. No! Yeah, I don't want to lose it. 
Yeah, I don't care if I die. The thing is, I got that stuff back. Uh, we do have 113 emeralds. I definitely want to get him back somehow. Dang it. There we go. And I already see the save point. Perfect. Holy crap. Not easy. That is for sure. I mean, I think uh, when I saw, when I first heard about this game, I saw that it is gonna be quite difficult to to play. But um, I mean, this is not that difficult. It is totally doable. That's for sure. What? Crap. I hated that you die instantly from these from these things. Yeah, I kind of lost a little bit of coins here, or emeralds, whatever these are. What? How the heck am I supposed to do that jump? I don't get it. Let's keep at it, I guess. I think there is five more old way up here, that's why... <sighs> Seriously? I want to start spending some of these coins that I keep on getting. I just don't exactly know how long I gotta keep on going here. Oh, and I see how you do this. I get it. You gotta do it from above, not from below as I was trying to. And of course, I messed up. This game is not easy. And there wasn't any possibility to choose the difficulty I want to play on. So this is definitely not fun. <laughs> All right, let's keep on. Let's keep on going. Man, this is not easy at all. Let's try this again. What? How are you supposed to do this? I know that if you touch the wall, you can actually glide on it. But the problem is, these walls are so close to each other. It's not easy. What? I think I'm just gonna lose all the um, air emeralds that I got. Look at this, I actually did. Yeah, I definitely lost all the freaking emeralds that I had. I got zero emeralds. Are you freaking kidding me right now? God dang it. You know what, I'm gonna stop doing all this. Because this is just a waste. I'm losing everything that I have, that I work for. That's definitely not worth it. Anyway, it is what it is. Let's start collecting some more and... Whenever there are these difficult puzzles, I'm just gonna ignore them. Um, hmm, there are two paths though. There is this one and there is the other one. What I want to do though, I want to go through here because I have a feeling this is going to take me to... A secret. Yeah, look at that. A secret right here. Interesting. What about if I try to go down some more? Oh, who is this? What? What the heck is this place? Mm -hmm. New potentially helpful stuff for sale. Souls and normally currency both accepted. Well, look at this. So this is what we gotta give this guy. So in order to buy the bone broth, we need to give this guy a hundred. Which of course, we don't have anymore. Unfortunately, we lost them all. We've uh, kind of spent it all stupidly. We've wasted it all, actually. We didn't spend it at all. Uh, hold up, where are we going here? Before we go here, I have a feeling this is actually the main path. I don't know why, but I'm pretty sure this is going to be the main path. So let's try to go... ...up to here again. No! Are you kidding me? What? I hate this. God dang it. I wish there was a way to freaking save your stuff. What the heck? Oh my god. Anyway, we got 26. So pissed right now. Really, really pissed right now. Because there is no way to save all the emeralds that you're getting. Alright, anyway. There we go, we are back. Now, before we do anything, I do want to go... Uh, not up here. I want to go all the way here and see what this... 
is all about. Okay, we are gonna have to save the game first before we do that, actually. Let's try it again. What? Come on! There we go. Yeah, I think I'm getting a hang of it. And we should have a safe right here. Or a secret, I should say. Oh, hold up. There we go. We got this opened. Interesting. What about inside here? Chest. There we go. Well, at least we got a few more souls or whatever these are called. I'm gonna have to find that out real soon. Um, I do want to pay attention here and make sure I don't lose them again. Because it really, really sucks when you're working so hard and eventually you're losing them. Alright, let's try to make it all the way back then. No, are you kidding me? There we go, buddy. Not easy stuff, that's for sure. Alright, so we don't have to go here again and waste all our stuff. That was so stupid of me. But uh, it is what it is. You learn from your mistakes, right? All learn from our mistakes. Or at least this is what we should all do. Learn from our mistakes. Alright, there we go. We got this. Perfect. Uh, we don't have to go through here. I think we've already gotten everything. So let's just make it all the way to these fellas. Unfortunately, I don't have enough coins in order to purchase what I need. Because I wasted it all like an idiot. Oh my god. Holy crap. There we go, buddy. And we got it saved. Perfect. And this one is gonna take us to the secret chest if I'm not mistaken. What the f crap was that? Oh, there's traps around here. Get it, we gotta pay attention for these. <laughs> these are awesome. Loving it. Oh crap. Almost dead though. Gotta pay attention. We got it saved. Perfect. And look at this. The secret chest. Finally. Now unfortunately, again, I don't have enough coins here in order to buy that stuff, but it is what it is. Are you kidding me? <laughs> At least we spawn back in with full health, that's for sure. That is okay. Let's grab all this stuff, and let's get the heck out of here. Holy crap, so much stuff. Perfect, we got health. <laughs> that is awesome. They got activated in the chain. Really love it. And I think... Uh, oh, what is this? Death count, 48? You know you don't get it worth for dying a lot, right? <laughs> I know, but there's nothing I can do. There's absolutely nothing I can do. Uh, let's see... Oh! What's up with this guy? This tunnel is nearly finished and functional. I'll add it to your map so you can find it later. Ah, that is awesome! So I think we can use this to fast travel back home, right? After Vale and Red Kingdom. Interesting. I wish there was a way I could maybe store all the um, emeralds or souls that I'm collecting. What's up with these rats? Away with you, corpse! You've no business here! Yeah, your bat looks hungry and I hate it! <laughs> Seriously? Come on, buddy. Leave this place. Give me all the coins that I can get. Hmm. Upon careful inspection, I have deducted that you cannot jump over this chasm. No kidding. This is bad. We need to get up there somehow. I don't know, Skulls. It kind of seems like we're out of luck here. Unless you plan on growing wings in the next few seconds, we have no choice but leave. Imber, you're a genius! Those ventilators fans down there. Oh, I think I'm gonna have to activate those somehow. Yeah, what about them? Why are you... Oh, no, 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 no. If you think for even a second that I'm going to... Pick me up and fly me across! <laughs> you are carving up the wrong corpse here, pal. If those fans are on, they will—they should blow hard enough to help you lift me. 
Uh, look, we don't even know how to turn the fans on. What's the point in discussing it? Oh, wait. What? What's up with those rats? Dinner? What the? <laughs> huh? I think they want us to follow them. It can't hurt anything, but maybe we'll find our way around if you keep on their tail. Was that a pun? What do you mean? Rats have tails. I know. Got it. Not a pun. <laughs> Let's get going before we lose them. Alright, so apparently I have a feeling those rats might help me somehow. Don't exactly know how, but um, you know what guys, I think uh, we are actually gonna have to end this first episode right here for now. I gotta tell you, I'm really really enjoying this. The look of the game is definitely something that I'm really loving featuring on this channel. I'm definitely looking for more and more games like this to, uh, to feature on the channel. So if you guys know more like this, please make sure to let me know down in the comments below. And also if you enjoy this and want to see more Skull Attack, Make sure you hit on that like button down below, as that will help me quite a lot. And if you guys are new here and have subscribed yet, please consider doing that, as I'm posting videos just like this one every single day, playing many more indie adventure games and puzzle games that I'm pretty sure you'll enjoy. Alrighty everybody, stay safe, and I'll see you all in the next one soon. Bye!